but I'm optimistic that all in all, we're looking at a great forecast. Yeah, yeah. But so exciting. So since it's Friday, it's the moment of truth again. Yes. We're having a whole new question. We have a, a new, fear, you new question. Fear. And I think that, Marco, you're going to like this one. Okay. So and my last one is a total complete guess. So we'll, see what <laughs> well, you got that one right. So yeah. we'll see if you can go two for two today for your Friday's weather trivia. This is our second question of the day. We have which weather term does not have professional sports team named after it. So that's NBA, oh. NFL, MLB, NHL. Oh, okay. So we got four weather terms here. Thunder, lightning, I think I know this one. hail, and sun. So which one of these is not I know, Danielle, I know you're scared a sports you're team? I knew as soon as we were talking. <laughs> See, Marco and I were talking about oh, sports yes. yesterday because go Knowles, yeah. the Seminoles won the cheese it Bowl. Well, won so we're like talking about night, sports though. earlier. So now here's our sports question for the day. Oh boy. So, I think I know this one. I think you probably yeah. do. Do you know, Danielle? I'm going to say hail just because it sounds yeah. like not a sports team. Okay. Yeah. I don't know. Okay. Yeah. Well, we'll see. I mean, we'll, we'll, we'll take another educated guess and hopefully we'll get it right. <laughs> yeah. So, yeah. Well, for the next half hour, we'll have the answer for that. So yeah. stick around. Fun to have two different questions. Yeah. yeah. Well, thanks so much, Jessica. Well, we'll see the moment of truth coming up next. But here's an interesting New Year's survey. Although people all across the country plan to host parties. Now, in fact, nearly one third of people surveyed say they absolutely will host a party. So we found some fun facts to help you be a better host and a guest. Now, according to the one poll for how do you say that? Chenate? Ch Chenate? <laughs> survey, <most, laughs> survey, most people think it's rude to overstay your welcome or Ooh. leave before midnight. Yeah. So have you all done this before? Okay, so my family, <laughs> I grew up, we hosted a party every single year. And um, we, it was usually with teenagers. Okay. Already we're looking at people that are a little yeah. bit on the younger side. Yeah. And usually people start to wrap up around 1231. Okay. But I agree that leaving before midnight, unless yeah. you have a baby, yeah. maybe, <laughs> kids at home, yeah. I, leaving before midnight's not a good look. Yeah, I know. I know our reporter Natasha's yeah. joining us. So she yeah, wants to join us on this conver yeah. conversation. So what do you think? I think uh, 2.30 will probably be the good cutoff for yeah, me. Yeah, 2.30. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay, so like, morning was two, probably a little too late at this point. 2 a.m. is <laughs> usually the cutoff time anywhere. Right. So it's yeah. like, okay, as long as you can make it 2 a.m. Yeah, like, you know, well, I think I think 1 a.m. 1 a.m. I know. Give that's it a yeah. little bit after midnight because that's one. what everyone's waiting for. Well, I mean, yeah. Yeah, growing up with like a Hispanic family, you know how yeah. long it's gonna take to say goodbye. Yeah. So that's 30 true. minutes after two o'clock. So that's it's good. gonna be four in the morning by the time you're. Yeah, that's <laughs> awesome. You're smart. I like yeah. that. Yeah. Well, other things in this <laughs> survey, the perfect time to leave the party is with an hour after the ball drops. So anytime before 1 a.m. Okay. So there you go. So 1 a.m. is the the special hour. Sounds, the sounds hour good. To dig. Well, the average host typically invites about 19 guests, but in this survey, around 70 percent of hosts say they plan to invite more people. So I've never hosted a party before, so I don't yeah. really have experience in this, but mm -hmm. have y'all hosted parties before? And I if so, yet. once. Once, how and many people? And I think probably no more than 10. No more than 10? 10. 10. Yeah. I think uh, my parents were not in town, so I kept them very limited, yeah. you know? So. <laughs> It's hard. I feel like the more people, the more, uh, I guess, difficult yeah, it is. Yeah, you don't want this to get out of hand. Yeah, and yeah, in the past, I was like 20 plus. And now I'm like a 10 and under 10 kind and of under, girl. Yeah. yeah. What, what about you? I, no, I haven't had a host. No, a never. I don't think I want to. That's a lot of pressure. Well, this year, right? you know where we're going to be. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I know. We're not going to be. I know. Gonna be. <laughs> I know. So uh, that's a lot of pressure because you have to get the food and the entertainment. See, and you're going to be before and after. It's like work it. within itself. I feel like a host can enjoy it. Yeah. But. If you're going to invite more than 10 to 15 people, my personal opinion is have everyone bring a side. Yeah. That's how you make things a lot easier. Yeah. Yeah. You only have to provide maybe the main course or the main mm -hmm. snack, whatever yeah. that might be. Yeah. Tell everybody to bring some food. I mean, it's pretty easy to pick yeah. up a veggie tray or a fruit yeah. tray. Yeah. Chips. Um, chips. I mean, yeah, yeah everyone, can, everyone can contribute yeah. something. Makes everything so much easier. And then yeah. something yeah. everybody has something they like. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. You have this yeah. organized. That's true. So, organizations, that's <laughs> organizations, the number one priority if you want to have this yes. successful host. <laughs> well, the top party essentials, according to the survey, are a good theme, food, music, and drinks. Like y'all just said, yeah. so there you go. What, yeah. what kind of music do y'all like like to play in a party though? Everything. Every everything. A little bit of everything, yeah. 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 You gotta have a good mix. Yeah. Gotta yeah. have some dancing songs, mm -hmm. yeah. gotta have some slower songs. Yeah. yeah. Um, maybe the top hits of the have year. Of everything. Like true. I said, I'm an oldies. Yeah, like that's true. music, so like 70s, 80s, 90s, early 2000s. 90s, 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 90s. All right, well, I have a question for y'all, and that is, have y'all seen the glasses for 2023 yet? Yeah. Every year I ask myself, how are they gonna make Right. glasses out of this With that year. Number? I haven't seen them Blows yet, my but mind. I think they're using the bottom yeah. of the three right for the second act, so. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, lots to do. Well, now we know what we're going to do for a party now. Yeah, yeah. we can play. We'll stick with us. Time now, 625. We'll be right back. 